students, yes, uh, students, I have some terrible news that I have to share with you right away. It cannot wait a single, s uh, wait, is this recording? Hello? Am I muted? Uh, no? N no, uh, uh, okay. Am I talking loud enough? Maybe if I get closer. <laughs> uh, there. That, that's better. Yeah. Uh, as I was saying, I have some truly devastating information. Our musical has been cancelled. You have all worked so hard and I was so looking forward to our dress rehearsal tonight. But now... I am sorry to report our production of Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical, will never see the light of day. The world will never know your interpretation of this great American classic. <laughs> They always say the show must go on, but in this case, it can't. Uh, 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 um, that's, uh, I should go. Um, goodbye for now. Uh, how do I hang this thing up? Um, uh, Siri, end video. Oh, oh okay, good. Yes, right. <clears throat> Hello? Oh, um, hi, Principal Amanda. Yes, I know the show is cancelled. What? No! The drama department can't shut down permanently! Uh, I know the musical was supposed to raise money for next year, but... No, don't go! We can't get rid of the entire drama pro... Oh, the video didn't end. Maybe if I press this button that says send. Calling all casting crew. Did you see that video? Wow, Tash does not know how to use technology. But more importantly, we can't lose the drama department. We have to do something, no matter what obstacles we face. Life mirrors art, and this is just like in our musical. Like Bob Flossie says at the start of Brushes with Greatness. We don't give up. We don't give in, we journey on, we rise again. Although we face our greatest foe, we don't give up. Yes, this I know, we'll tell that black and ginger virus just to stay away. With brush and floss together, we can keep back the decay. Well, Maybe it's not like that last part, but you know what I mean. Let me know what you think. Hello, fellow lesbians. I'm speaking to you all from inside of my closet, where I retreated as soon as I heard the terrible news. I've decided to hide away in here. After all, if there is no musical theatre, what is the point of going outside? I will hide away for, for the rest of my life, nestled in one of my old costumes, tap shoes, and last year's sign poster of Susie Called the Musical. I was a great yet for the turtle, wasn't I? Don't cry for me, former castmates. I'll be fine, I'll be here. Tweeting at Lin Manuel Miranda, whilst quietly humming the score to Pippin for the rest of eternity. Good luck with the rest of your lives. So long, farewell, I'll be the saying goodbye. And scene. Look, we can't just crawl into our clothes. We have to bring brushes with great into life and save the drama program. I have an idea. You know how we're all sending videos to each other right now? We can do the show online, just like this. I mean, if you can on a Ben Platt's used titular online, you can definitely do a show online. What kind of person would order a forty pound used tissue on the internet? Totally ridiculous. Nobody would. I know I wouldn't. Yuck. 
All I'm saying is you can do a lot online. We could piece the scenes and make a full musical. Achoo! Oh dear. Hello, Lansom. What have I done? Yes, that is a genius idea. Not the £40 t-shirts though. That's ridiculous. But a virtual musical is a great idea. We could perform Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical. And we could do it at home and stream it online. Check it out. I can do the opening number from my living room. Ever since your mouth appeared that had some teeth There has been a silent battle just beneath And who fights the battle? We've known them since youth Our heroes Bob Flossie and Tommy Tooth Come listen to the brush, 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 brush It's with greatness, a musical inside your jaw Brush, 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 brush it with greatness. Just sit back and say, ah. Only problem is, Tash hates technology. So, how are we going to get her to agree? But after hearing that song, I say we go for it. The show must go online. Please reach out to me if you have any questions about your performance or the technology. I have a Hotmail account and an AOL account. I am very connected. You have all inspired me and given me hope. Now, let the dress rehearsal begin! Siri, send video. Uh, wait, no. Siri, send. That should do it. Oh, I wonder how they found out the drama department was in danger, Mr. Whiskers. Do you know? Me either. Did you know I performed in Cats once, Mr. Whiskers? I was tremendous. Mm. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, look, Mr. Whiskers, this, this didn't send. Siri, you a troublemaker. Okay, I've got this. Send. So Tash sings to cats. 
Good to know. Anyway, dress rehearsal. I was thinking, since we're at home, we could get creative and sing some of the toothbrushing songs in an actual bathroom with an actual toothbrush and toothpaste. Check it out. This could be great for the big plague battle at the end of the show, when plague is all like... This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sounds. And the hero comes in and saves the day like... No rituals on dividing families Kiss play goodbye and dividing families The truth won't be pulled out Good, right? Wow, that was some great toothbrushing. Amazing form. So I guess it was kind hard to hear the lyrics. Oh well, we'll work on that later. I've been working on Plaque Song in the Great Gun Canyon all day. I think I finally figured out the perfect way to perform it at home. I had some interruptions before, but that's all sorted of now. This is scene three, take six. I like it, Q U I E T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How I like a lovely hush away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa la la, tra la la, shoo do 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 Quiet time for me. Guess what? I have a Tough. She can sit, stay sometimes. She eat, eat. She eats a lot actually. She also sleeps a lot. I'd say she's a stellar sleeper. She's great at sniffing, looking. I'm great at just being the best, you know. I know this has nothing to do with the musical, but look how cute she is. Have you ever seen something this cute before? That's it, I just wasted over a minute of your life. Bye! And now, back to the musical. There's a trusted costume designer here. Now, as our costumes are start at school, doesn't mean we can't get creative at home. After all, this is our dress rehearsal. As we discussed last week, yep, yeah, sure, it's last week. Now, our base costumes are going to be black. That means no logos and no designs. And yes, that does include your Olaf t-shirt, Toby. Let it go. And now for Toby and my other toothbrushes. I want you guys to find any hairbrushes. 
and tape them to your um, hand like this. Like this. And then you do the same with your other hand. Now perhaps you can pretend to be a toothbrush singing and dancing easily. Or perhaps if you was trying to pick something up. Oh, never mind. Just get creative people, just don't let me down. Thanks for the costume tips. Now, this next song is the emotional centre of the entire story. That heart-wrenching moment when Tommy Tooth apologises. I've been practicing my expressions in the mirror all day, and I think I've achieved an audio McDonald level performance. But all I have to do is capture it on camera. But that's easy enough. Here I go. <laughs> when you look at my face, you can clearly see I need you. When you look at my heart, you will understand I care. If you take a deep look into my eyes, you see a soul that never lies. My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Wow, that was, um, well, your voice sounded great, but the camera work was a bit off. I have an idea that might make things a bit easier, though. What if Tommy Tooth was played by an actual toothbrush? That way you can really see their full body whilst they're singing. Brilliant, right? Hello, from your lighting designer, I thought I'd demonstrate a few ways you can use lighting design at home. For instance, you could turn the lights on or off. This is a blackout. And you can also use a lamp. And hmm, I guess you could turn some on and some off um yeah i think that's about it good luck i guess lights off spotlight on me as you all know this next song contains the most important information in the entire musical which is why i am demonstrating it for you it's the big reveal and the stakes are extremely high. If the audience misses this, the whole show will fall apart. So we all need to be extremely clear, like so. As we ready for this battle, our babies battle yet. I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who makes the evil forces win. And his name is... Line? What's the line? Right, right, okay, okay. He is caring, he is daring, he is everybody's friend. 
friend And his name will live forever I'll remember to the end I've met him once, I've loved him ever since And his name is... Who was it again? Alright, okay, okay And his name is... I guess we'll never know his name then, will we? This is your stage manager here we are moments away from going live. Now, I want you to remember, stay calm. You are going to be fine. Fine. I'm fine. Are you fine? I'm sure you are. Because calm is contagious and I am totally calm. <laughs> Now, you are all doing great, really good stuff, but I do have a few little notes just before we go live, okay? Okay! Number one, find a quiet spot to record. Number two, remember your lines, especially the important ones. Number three, do not sing with a toothbrush in your mouth. I'm begging you. Number four, make sure the camera is pointed at your face when you are singing about your face. Number five, for goodness sake, please do not buy a 40 pound used tissue online. It's not about the show. But just don't do it, okay? Okay, we are about to go live. Remember, this is just for family and friends, so there is no pressure. Just remember to have fun and somehow Kristen Bell found out about our show and she's tweeted a live link to our performance and she's hosting a virtual viewing party and over 50,000 people have our S V Peed. But that's fine, right? Okay. Places, it's showtime. Ah! Hello to all our viewers and welcome to our virtual theater. My students tell me this is being broadcast live over the interwebs. Thank you all for joining us. As always, I would like to remind you to unwrap your candy and turn off your devices now. Oh, a message. Ah, my stage manager is telling me that you're all actually watching this on your devices, so leave them on, I guess. That's neat. Huh. Anywho, some of you have been with us since the beginning from our first production of In the Tights, a Shakespeare and hip hop opera. Those were the days. And some of you are experiencing our drama club for the very first time. We would like to thank all of you for your continued support. This program means so much to us and we would hate the thought of losing it for forever. Never mind all that. Now, without further ado, I give you Brushes with Greatness, the Dental Hygiene Musical. 
Curtain up. Ever since a mouth appeared that had some teeth, there has been a silent battle just beneath. And who fights that battle? We've known them since youth. Our heroes, Bob Lussie and Tommy Tooth. Oh, here comes the black. I'm a man with the enamel and the gums. Change of ice is my very best of chums. And this we will attack. You're laughing, then so hiding. Watch your back. Come and listen to your brush, brush and brush and brush, brush it with greatness. A musical inside your jaw. Wisdom teeth and holy mode is in a cast. Yeah, brace yourself for Satan's excitement. Hold it fast. Welcome to our show. Brushes with greatness. Tommy Tooth, the legendary toothbrush? Is that you? Who's asking? It's me, Bob Flossie, your old boss pal. I haven't seen you since the deep cleaning of 92 when you banished Halitosis. She was awful. You were legendary. That was a long time ago, Flossie. I don't clean mouths no more, I'm retired. But we got ourselves a plaque situation, and no one cleans like you. Plaque's too big for me now, kid. There's no hope. I give up. No! I refuse to accept that. We don't give up. We don't give in. We journey on. We rise again. Although we face our greatest foe. We don't give up. Yes, this I know. We'll tell that plaque and ginger bite. All right, Flossie, I'm in. Hey, it's me, Flack, and I think I found the perfect place to live. This mouth is amazing. Look at all the tartar and build up in this glorious Gum Canyon. Shh, do you hear that? No, it's because it's the sound of perfect silence and serenity. Not a toothbrush or floss in sight. And I'm sure they aren't hiding anywhere nearby eavesdropping. Amazing! I like it, Q-U-I-E-T, yes, quiet is the best for me. How I like the lovely hush, away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa-la-la, tra-la-la, shoo dee doo dee dee it's shh, quiet time for me. This is the best. I'm so glad I banished Tommy Tooth, Bob Flossie, and the most terrible mouth cleaner of all, he who must not be named. I like the food quite sugary. Yes, candy fills my heart with glee. Nothing like a sweet old snack to give a boost a good old plaque. That's me. Forget to floss, I'm the boss. Thank you for setting me free. It's shh. Quiet time for me. My name is P L A Q E. I mean, Nui. -E. I'm working on a cavity. My favorite word of all is neglect. I strike when you least expect. Say yay, DK, every day. Cavity, cavity, wee. It's shh, quiet time for shh. Quiet time for, shh, quiet time for me. Cannot deny it, I love it so quiet, the science is what I enjoy. Hey Tommy Tooth, did you hear what Plaque just said as we were totally eavesdropping? Sure did, kid. Who is he who must not be named? Sounds like he's our only hope at defeating Plaque. Do you know him? Do I? As we ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget The one that makes the evil forces wince 
And his name is Harold Harold Ritz. He is daring, he is caring, he is everybody's friend. And his name will live forever, I'll remember till the end. I met him and I've liked him ever since. And his name is Harold Ritz, the way bacteria, that's what he does best. Harold will take care of so brave. If Mouse the royal, he would be the prince. My old friend, it's me, Tommy Tooth. I knew I'd find you here in the canine cavern. Wait, before you scamper off, just hear me out. I'm, I'm sorry about the uh, peanut butter on the roof of the mouth mishap of 87. I know I blamed you, but I was the one to blame. Now, we have a serious plat problem and we need your help, partner. Please, I'm begging you. Harold, I know we've been down this road before And you said you'd never work with me again Yes, I know I've made mistakes It's the tooth that costs and aches But know that you will always be my friend When you look at my face You can clearly see I need you When you look in my heart you will understand I care How would I do care if you take a deep look into my eyes You'll see a soul that never lies My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes Oh Harold, I love you too Now let's go pulverise some plaque Plaque? Why couldn't you have stayed away for once? Harold Rince Tell me too Bob Flossy, the dental trifecta. You betcha, and I want you out of this mouth. Again, this is my turf now, and I think this tooth is ready for extraction. Don't you? No, not the molar. This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sound. Leave that tooth alone. Never! Well then it's time for battle. No roots will die defying cavities. Kiss black goodbye defying cavities. The tooth won't be pulled out. I won't go easy and neither will my friend Gingivitis. Oh no! There's two of them! That's right. And we're gonna wreck this tooth. Wait, you have no reason. Beautiful, this mouth would be so beautiful. I know every molar and incisor could be clean. Dark. Get them! made her off, off, off Broadway debut. I want to thank you all for tuning in. Really, it means the world to us and... Oh, goodness, I'm terribly sorry. No phones in the theater. Um, I should go. Talk to you later. Thank you, thank you all. Hmm, <clears throat> hello? Principal Amanda? Oh, you watched. 
They did. They do. Oh, thank you. That's wonderful news. Thank you for saving the drama club. Of course. Yes, we'll be back next year with Greasy, the car mechanic musical. All right. Thanks again. Talk to you later. Oh, is this still recording? What is up with this technology? It's almost as if I left it on on purpose. Well, since I have you here, kids, if you're watching, thank you. You were wonderful. Even though you weren't together, you worked as an ensemble and created something special. I am truly grateful to be your teacher, and I am so glad the show went online. Show